Well, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of YouTube. This is Pastor Dow. Hey, I just got finished getting a smile on my face. You know the reason why? I have actually found hope in one more person here in the United States of America. I had someone actually uh, take me up on my challenge, as strange as I may sound to some of you out there, and actually researched what I said in the video you know, unified in lies, but divided in truth. I had someone make this comment, and this is what they said. They said, Shalom, everyone. Since I've seen and listened to Pastor Dowell's last video regarding Thanksgiving, I've been researching the day of mourning and found that I've been lied to by this society about what Thanksgiving is really all about. My mind is literally blown away. I suggest instead of just jumping on the quote unquote Pastor Dow is a liar bandwagon, do your homework. You will find that not only is he telling the truth, you will find a conviction in your heart to get the truth out. You are right, Pastor. Living a lie is easy. It's also cowardly. Thanks for opening my eyes. I'll continue to be in prayer today. Well, there you have it. Hey, that's someone that rather than defending what they believe at one time to be the truth, they set out to say, you know what? Let me go check out and see what this man is talking about. And for the first time in their life, guess what? Now their conscience is open to truth. Now you know what happens from this point on? Anything that I say from this point on, and they're going to be listening to me on this channel, they're going to go back and research it. And you know what? We gonna find out just how deep the rabbit hole goes. You know, I did want to just stop the video right there, but the same person decided to continue on their research. And then they sent this um, in the comments. Associated Press, AP, Boston.com. Native Americans marking Thanksgiving with a day of mourning. 8.21 a.m. All right. Plymouth, Massachusetts. Members of Native American tribes from around New England are gathering in the town where the pilgrims settled for a solemn National Day of Mourning observance. Thursday's noon gathering in downtown Plymouth, Massachusetts will recall the disease, racism, and oppression that European settlers brought. In the 48th year that the United American Indians of New England have organized the event on Thanksgiving Day. All right. Moon Nalem James, a co-leader of the group, says Native people have no reason to celebrate the arrival, the arrival of the pilgrims in 1620. James says, today we say no thanks, no giving. Along with prayers, and public speeches participants will condemn environmental degradation and government restrictions on immigration. They also plan a stomp dance to symbolize stomp out aptoid addiction, aptoid addiction, which has ravaged many native communities. Well, there you have it. You see, look what happens when truth is presented to you. What happens to your mind, especially when you, if you have the spirit of truth and he's dealing with you, uh, he'll lead you and guide you. But first you got to hear a preacher. You got to hear somebody bring forth something that you yourself always believe to be true, come to find out it's a lie. Guess what else is a big lie too? Going to church on Sunday, calling it the Sabbath and a rest day and saying that uh, Jesus gave us the Lord's day Sunday. I beg the different. I say that the Sabbath is the Lord's day. Anybody want to challenge me on that? You just heard the truth, and it's the true straight way. Let's continue to see how deep the rabbit hole goes of all these lies. 
We're going to hit Santa Claus, too. That's the biggest lie of the year. Sure does make a lot of merchandise and a lot of money, though, don't it? 